my name is Gabriel from Galap Technologies. In this class, we are going to explain what to do if you uh, lose your internet connection. Like here, we are showing you what to check before calling the internet service provider. So, what you should have in your cable modem is this these connections, the, the, the light that says online, it should be on all the time. If it is blinking or it is off, of course you will not have uh, internet. What you have to do, if that happened before calling the internet service provider, is just turn off the, the device. So. You, the thing you, that you have to do is unplug the the cable modem, like it shows on the arrow that it shows I, I'm trying. Once you do that, you just plug it back in, wait for a few minutes, and then try again if you have internet or not. Otherwise you will have to try the same thing with a router. If you have a router connected to your connection, you should do the same thing. Because sometimes these, kind, these devices, they free, so they, they have little hangouts like computers uh, do. And once it happens, the, the fast way to, to to unfreeze or to restart the, the system, it just unplug the cables and plug it back again. Another thing that you have to check is that the cables that you have, the Ethernet cables, are uh, connected in the right position. So, what you have to do, like I show you here, is the Ethernet uh, cable, you have to uh, connect it to the WAN port. It's W-A-N. If you, if you have it connected there, everything should work just fine. Other thing that you have to keep in mind, the LAN port that I am showing you right here, they have to be connected to the computer. So if you, you, if you connect it in any of those ports, it will be the same, same it, all those ports work the same, so it's the same thing. In different routers, you have um, the port, the LAN port and the WAN port. Uh, they might be together, but uh, you can difference, differentiate them through the color. Like in this case, they are separate, but in another brand, they are together, but the color is what makes it uh, different. So that is the thing that you have to keep in mind. Other thing that it happens, sometimes these kind of rotors, when they get old, they stop working. So if that happens, you should try to buy a new one. But before buying a new one, you should be able to surf on internet if you connect just the cable modem uh, directly to the computer. I'll show you how. To do that, just connect the Ethernet cable directly to the computer. When, once you do that, the thing that you have to do is unplug the cable modem. Once the cable modem is off, plug it back in and then wait for a few minutes and you should be ready to go. I explain to you what is all this light. The first light is the power light that shows you that the device has electricity. The second one and the third one, the second one says receive, the, sec the third one says send. Those ones are when the, you are sending, receiving information. So it, that is happening all the time when you surf on the internet, you send a file, receive it. The online, the online light is like I said before, it is the signal that the, your provider send it to you. If there is some issue with the cable or, the, or there is not enough signal, the line might be off or will be blinking. 
And the, and the other one, the, the one that say activity, that is blinking right now, that is the one that shows the cable modem is connected to the router or is connected to the PC. So, with those uh, things in mind, you should be able to reconnect your, connect, your connection uh, if there is any, any issue. Another thing that you have to keep in mind, uh, on the top you have a, a, standard, a standby button. So, if you don't have any light or if, if you have just one that says standby in, on the bottom of the cable modem, press that and see if all the lights uh, comes again. So that's it. If you have any issue or any question, just send us an email or send us a comment on on this video video below or call us whatever is more convenient for you i hope you like this video and i hope to see you soon thank you